Hi, this is Jason with PortForward.com. In this video, I'm going to show you what to do if your router is not on the supported routers list in pfconfig. Let's go ahead and launch pfconfig. And then I want you to click on Tools, Select Router. If your router is not listed, go ahead and pick this not listed item. And then my router is not listed over here for the model. Click Next, ignore this screen, and click Finish. That tells pfconfig to run a generic set of instructions that's going to look at your network and get some information that might help us add support for your router. Click Update Router to have it go ahead and run that setup. Now it's gathered some information that we would like to see to add support for your router, but it hasn't sent it to us yet. So you can click on Help, Request Help to get a hold of us. So you click on Help, Request Help, and this is our Request Help screen. Step one says try updating your router at least once. You've done that. And then step two says click here to generate a new ticket number. So you're going to do that. It's going to gather a little bit more network information and then send all that information off to our servers. You can see it says your ticket number here is 93415. You, of course, will have a different ticket number. And that information is now sitting on the portforward.com servers ready for either Tad or Alan to look at. What I need you to do at this point in time is click log in to our web support system, which will take you to a web page where you can tell us exactly what is wrong, why you clicked generate a ticket number, and we'll get back to you within 24 hours and start working on the process of adding support for your router. We're usually pretty good at it. We're usually pretty quick at it. So don't hesitate to get in there and ask us for help. Be sure to watch other videos at portforward.com if you need some more help. Thanks for watching.